Hi and welcome everybody. Um, I want to talk about something that's been giving me a problem for a while and I'm pretty sure there's other people having the same problem and that is Android phones. I have the Galaxy S6 here but I'm pretty sure um, all Android phones have problems with pop-up ads and it generally comes from apps that are installed on your phone that are free and they drive in adverts some apps you pay for and it gets rid of the ads but either way you're gonna download you're gonna download something like for example photo grid which is gonna add ads to your phone now google automatically has control of what ads go into your phone i'm going to show you how to recognize this and how they do it so Stay with me here. I'm going to let's turn the phone to you here. But you're going to go to your phone. You're going to slide down and go to your settings at the top. All right. Some point here, connection, sound, and vibration. Blah blah blah. You're going to go down to Google, Google settings. Click on that, and then somewhere down there, you're going to see ads. Click on that. And then you will probably automatically have this on here. Um, add pers uh, personalization. If it's on, you need to switch it off. Once you do that, go to your ads by Google. It's going to load up a website. And you're going to go to ID controls, I think. Let me check. Make sure. Yeah, ID controls. Right there. I'm going to take you to another page. And go down to Google uh, settings ads. At the, click on that. And that will bring you to your ID. And you're going to go to, keep going down, Visit Ad Choices. There's other ways of finding this Visit Ad Choices, but this is the way I've just done it. So keep following me here. Click on that. All right. Now what's going to happen is... It's going to start loading up. Sorry about that. It brought up a message I've never seen before. I wanted to read what it said. It's going to bring up all the ads up on your phone here. See? All clicked on. There you go. So, once it's loaded, you're going to go to turn off all companies. And it should start working. Yeah, it's starting to switch them off. Some, it won't let you switch off. There you go. Now the... See these here? They're not switching off. I may have to do this one by one. Yes, yeah, switch them all off. I don't want any of these on. Alright, once you've done that, the problem is... Here, there's another one still switched on. Here, get rid of that. I don't think Microsoft will let you switch it off, you see? This is the problem that you have. Now, slowly, as you come off of here, doesn't matter if you save the settings or not, they're going to start switching on again over time. So if I click off, off, off here, I'll close down my settings, make sure everything's switched off. In time, they're going to start loading back up again. Then you have to go every day and switch them off, and it's annoying. So... Here's what you need to do. Once you've done switch them off, immediately, this is where the problems occurred for me. 
you need to go to something called let me find the uh this app here malware bytes it's called let me see if i can find it in the app store for you there you go so you're looking for it's installed already here once you've installed it, load it up, open, and it's going to come up with fixed issues. And you need to scan. I've already done my scan, but you can go to here and hit scanner, which I'm not going to do. It takes a while, and it'll scan through your phone for all the problems. Once that's happened, it should fix a lot of your pop-ups. Now. There's one more thing you can do to find out what apps are giving you the major problems. Where is it? Let me see if I can find it somewhere. There you go, anti-adware. So if I go to App Store, click off here. Sorry. There we go, anti adware. So this is what you're looking for. Open that. And this is a neat little trick. So all you're gonna do is go to scan now, and it's gonna scan through all the threads on your phone. No thanks, I don't wanna buy the original uh, the full version. Now look, it's got orange, 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 orange writing. That means that these are pop-ups that pop up in the in the apps itself, which is not a problem. When you get adverts in the app itself, unless you want to pay for it, it's not too much of a problem. Look, Twitter has um, um, most of most of apps have them say the truth. And now these are okay. I want to keep this. You can click on them. It can install them from here. If it's got red writing on there underneath you've got a big problem so you want to delete those if you don't want pop-ups once you've done that your phone should no longer have any problems let me go back so you can see me once you've done all that you should no longer get pop-ups anymore i did this two days ago i've tested it for two days i had no problems whatsoever so if you go through all the stages that i've showed you you shouldn't have any problems but if you do let me know if it doesn't work please i'd like to hear it and then do some more research but so far this has done good and I'm pretty happy with the results because it was driving me crazy and I know there's a lot of people out there having the same problems so if you like what you see please hit the subscribe button hit the thumbs up too don't forget if it helped you share it hit the share button hit the thumbs up make a comment because without spreading um, other people won't get the help and YouTube only show what they believe is helpful. Thank you very much. Take care, guys.